Researchers have found that there is a high correlation between personality traits and body shapes. Statistical studies conducted by different research institutions reveal that clues about who you are, your personalities, social functions, symptoms of various diseases, your chances of getting divorced, are all embedded in your body parts. Redhead. According to scientific research, people with red hair are the most sensitive to pain. During a surgery, they need 25% more anesthesia than other color-headed individuals. Blood type. If your blood type is O, you are 85% more likely to get bitten by mosquitoes. Height. According to research conducted at the Albert Einstein College of Medicine, short people are more likely to live longer than their taller counterparts. One of the genes linked to longevity, as the findings affirmed, is also responsible for short stature. Palm shape. Researchers have found that individuals with square palms are usually practical, logical, and have great mathematical skills. If you have long palm, you are likely an emotional person. Hips. The hips are a body feature peculiar to the women. A study conducted by the University in Leeds, England, has found that women with wider hips had the most partners and one-night affairs. Hands. If your ring finger is shorter than your index finger, you are less likely to develop heart disease or prostate cancer. Try to rest your hands naturally on a surface and be comfortable with your posture. If your fingers are spread apart, then you're probably self-dependent and adventurous. Toes. If your toes neatly graduate in size, for instance, each of your toes is a little longer than the one before, you are likely to be systematic, precise, and efficient person. If your big toe is much longer than your other toes, you are a smart and innovative thinker. Nose. Researchers have found that people with long noses usually are ambitious. They also have a good sense of business, great instincts, and good leadership skills. Moles. Moles are attractive and unique features of a body. Having a mole extraordinarily adds to your beauty. However, it signifies lots more than beauty. Having a mole on the forehead denotes wisdom, and those having theirs positioned on their chins tend to be mean, determined, and quite stubborn. Soft-hearted, sincere, and very caring personality are peculiar to having a mole on their cheeks. Ear. If you have a flat ear, there is a tendency of being extremely creative. While those having a slight difference between the upper and lower parts of their ears, in the form of thickness, are likely to be more intelligent. People having diamond-shaped ears are the moody types. And if you belong to the category of individuals with rectangular-shaped ear, you have a high possibility of being trustworthy. Round-eared people are characterized by their dependable, stable, and reliable personality. Smile. A study found that the way people smiled in old photographs predicts their success in marriage. Psychologists rated the smile intensity of people's college yearbook photos. They found that none of the biggest grinners got divorced in their life. In contrast, 25% of the most straight-faced individuals got divorced. Feet. Individuals with high feet arches are usually self-dependent, self-sufficient, and antisocial. Don't consider that as a bad personality though. It makes you unique. Nails. Changes such as discoloration or thickening in your nails can signal serious health issues, including heart or lung conditions, liver or kidney diseases, or even diabetes. Lips. If you have a full lip, it means you are likely to be generous and outgoing. Thinner or thin lips indicates the likelihood of being a loner. People with big lips tend to put others first before themselves, while their counterparts cherish independence in relationships. Forehead. A high forehead indicates cleverness and diligence. Hair. Hair can reveal some of our bad habits. For instance, some drugs when taken leave traces in our hair for years, and this was proven from the lock of hair snipped from the renowned English poet John Keats. 170 years after his death, traces of morphine he took when alive was seen in his snipped hair. Also, if you tend to pull at your hair, brows, or lashes when you get stressed, it can signal a perfectionist personality.